Hello, Lunar Child, and welcome to Friday. It's finally Friday, and it's going to be cloudy and rather private, I do believe, for the Cancers this weekend. You see, it is like cast day. The moon, your ruling planet, is conjuncting the sun, which is the most powerful day of the month to cast our intentions out to the universe. That's because we have the two most important ingredients, our awareness, which is the sun, so our awareness is kind of like the magnifying glass, and the moon, our emotions, putting our heart behind what we want. That's literally how you get something in life. Put your heart behind what you want. Walk the walk of what you want to have. Now, this all comes from the perspective of what you're learning this month, Cancer, which are trust and intimacy issues. Okay, You are learning where to put your boundaries. And boundaries are so important because they keep the bad people out. They let the right people in. Sounds like the hokey pokey all of a sudden. And it also allows you to have grow, to grow abundance. If you're constantly giving away because you have no boundaries, how are you ever going to raise abundance in your soul capital? You're not. So everything you want on Earth comes down this month to where you draw your boundaries. So let's say you want to light cast a brand new car. Well, today in your light cast ceremony, sure visualize a new car, but also visualize yourself not overspending your money. Visualize yourself not giving money to the homeless person because you've got to keep some for yourself. I'm not saying it's not good to donate, but if you want abundance and you want to manifest, you've got to have certain boundaries in place. See yourself telling no to your family because they want all your money after you won the lottery. It's through the boundaries, says the astrology, that you will come into what you want to manifest on the planet. So. What I recommend is a simple light cast ceremony. Go into a quiet space, fill your heart with love. That's super important. People always forget the love step. And then visualize your life and the consequences of it. Having said no to Joe Bob, how do you feel now? Having said no to your boss who is coming on too strong, how do you feel now? Actually look at and visualize the consequences of the boundary in place, not you holding up the boundary. Make it a given in your visualization that it will happen. Well, Cancer, that wraps up Lightcast Day and the weekend forecast. I'll see you on Monday with more Live Love Be. So garden down